So here we have the Art Deco. Um, this is the LA Colors that I referenced in the blog. Um, and you can see it's the Nail Art Lacquer. Um, and we picked a dark kind of bright green color to do for St. Patty's Day. So we're going to apply um, some of our shamrocks that we talked about for St. Patty's Day. And what I refer to this and why I picked this particular brand is because it's the nail art has a super thin um, brush, which you can see right here. So you want to get a pretty good amount on because you're going to be doing your, um, you want it to be kind of a bright color and it gives you the ability to kind of control a little bit more how your pattern's going to look. I'll do a three leaf clover here with the stem. And it actually would look a lot nicer if we did kind of a white background, but I didn't have any white nail polish, so um, I would normally do a white background and then the green would stand out a lot better. But we kind of did this spur of the moment for St. Patty's Day for going out. four leaf clover. Got a little bit more paint on here. You can see it's quite thin. The color doesn't stand out quite as well. So, But that's okay when you're doing your first coat because you don't want to make any mistakes. And if it's lighter and you do make a mistake, it's not a big deal. And then you just go over it and fix it up after to make it brighter. Like so. You can also do St. Patty's Hearts if you wanted to. And then do your stem. And you guys are probably the artists out there. I'll probably make a better one than me. This one looks a little mutilated. <laughs> but it's a neat idea anyway. And your kids can get into it. They can do some fun ones. You see I got bigger, small, medium, large. Anyway, so it gives you an idea for St. Patty's Day, something fun to do with your daughter. And uh, you can see I had one on here, but I wiped it off. This is still from St. Patty's Day. Something fun to do, something different, and uh, gets them into it. You can also add some sparkles and things like that. We bought some uh, sparkle eyeliner um, to do our eyes as well, which is really nice. And I can show you on my hand what that looks like. I'm not going to show you a close-up of my eyes because uh, that would just be silly. But you can see when you outline your eyelashes, it's a really nice um, sparkle on there. And that's the glitter liner. So you can do that on your eyes. It looks very nice. Anyway, so that's the ideas for St. Patty's Day to get all decked out to go to the pub. Have fun!